Hi, good morning, good afternoon, good evening. Whatever time it is for you in your geographical location, you are welcome to the short word for today's audio daily devotion. This is an audio narration of the written short word for today's daily devotion published every day and sent to our subscribers. One word from God can change your life forever. You are not listening to the short word for today by accident. No matter what you are going through, I want to assure you that God is turning it around in your favor. The foundation of the short word for today is Luke chapter 4 verses 18 and 19, quoting from the King James Version. Quote, The Spirit of the Lord is upon me, because he had anointed me to preach the gospel to the poor. He had sent me to heal the broken hearted, to preach deliverance to the captives and recovering of sight to the blind, to set at liberty them that are bruised, to preach the acceptable year of the Lord." Unquote. Welcome to our YouTube channel where we publish the Sure Word Audio Daily Devotion. This channel will inspire, motivate, encourage and give you the power to overcome every challenge in your life. For more encouraging words of faith, inspiration and the resources to overcome your challenges, subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon to receive instant notifications anytime we publish a new video. The affirmation for this week's short word for today, I will not be distracted. The short word for today devotion is a reading of the short word for today's devotion published every day on our website. You can visit our website for more resources. If you want to send in your prayer requests, feel free as you take the time to fill out the prayer request form on our home page at www.theshoreword.org.uk. Welcome to the reading of the Word of God from the Sure Word for Today. The Sure Word for Today is the abundance of the free favor of the Lord. Today's title for the Sure Word for Today series is Dealing with Distractions, Part 2 of 7. All Bible quotations are from the King James Version unless otherwise stated. This week's Bible verse is from the book of Proverbs chapter 4 verse 25. Quote, Let thy eyes look right on, and let thy eyelids look straight before thee. Unquote. The most dangerous enemy of humanity is not ignorance, but the illusion of having knowledge. Since you lack knowledge of your distractors in various aspects of your life, you are doomed. All your effort will be a waste of time. You must be aware of false knowledge. It is more dangerous than Satan. The first step towards knowledge is to know that you are indeed ignorant. Stop talking and pay attention so you can unroot your ignorance. Don't talk too much because your ignorance is more significant than your knowledge. You have so many things, some of which you are not aware of, that waste your time and reduce you to nothing. One of which is a distraction. You can accomplish more and become more successful by minimizing distractions and removing time wasters from your day. Distraction is hurting you more than you realize. We are beginning to accept distraction as standard with the way things are. This results in increased stress, anxiety, and mental health issues. It is said that it takes about 30 minutes to refocus after you get distracted. For this reason, you need to guide your attention. Distraction is not the main issue, but the post-distraction period is. Even if you only get distracted a few times a day, the amount of time you lose as you struggle to get back into your happy workplace is significant. If you get distracted three times a day, you lose about 90 minutes of your valuable time. Getting distracted causes your brain to multitask. You might be thinking multitasking means you are smart and a genius. Not really. 
Neuroscientists' research suggests that multitasking kills your performance and may even damage your brain. Multitasking is less productive than doing a single thing at a time. You may feel that you are paying attention in a meeting and reading up about a new creative brief at the same time. Still, chances are you won't retain information from either source. The brain is not designed for multitasking. You pay steeper metabolic costs to shift your attention. The brain consumes for more oxygenated glucose during the changeover. If you often switch back and forth between tasks, you could feel disoriented or exhausted. We have reached the end of part 2 of the Shoreward Audio Devotion series titled Dealing with Distractions. We are getting ready to read God's Word, the Shoreward Capsule. I would like you to read this at least once, twice or three times a day. Whatever you are going through, this Word will help you. If you start with me and repeat every word that I read, you'll be blessed. To not leave gaps in this recording, I will join you to repeat the short word capsule. Please read after me. This year is going to be an incredible year for me. This year is going to be an incredible year for me. This year, my dreams are coming true. This year, my dreams are coming true. I started the year and will continue every day. I started the year and will continue every day. Sending and receiving peace and love. Sending and receiving peace and love. A tremendous productive and successful time is starting now. A tremendous productive and successful time is starting now. I choose to be happy every day of this year. I choose to be happy every day of this year. Day by day, my financial condition is improving. Day by day, my financial condition is improving. I have a great job with good pay. I have a great job with good pay. I have a fantastic product that will generate a tremendous amount of money. I have a fantastic product that will generate a tremendous amount of money. I have now all the money I need. I have now all the money I need. Money is flowing now to my bank account from various sources. Money is flowing now to my bank account from various sources. Everything I do turns into sources. Everything I do turns into sources. Everything in my life is improving. Everything in my life is improving. I know I can achieve anything I want in life. I know I can achieve anything I want in life. Prosperity flows to and through me. Prosperity flows to and through me. I will succeed by attracting people who can help me. I will succeed by attracting people who can help me. My actions create constant wealth, prosperity, and abundance. My actions create constant wealth, prosperity, and abundance. I am happy with who I am and can be. I am happy with who I am and can be. Today, I will bid farewell to old habits and welcome a positive change in my life. Today, I will bid farewell to old habits and welcome a positive change in my life. I am the architect of my faith. I am the architect of my faith. I can achieve what I have dreamt for myself. I can achieve what I have dreamt for myself. I feel healthy and full of energy. I feel healthy and full of energy. Every day of my life is full of happiness and joy. Every day of my life is full of happiness and joy. Day by day, more and more sunshine is filling my life. Day by day, more and more sunshine is filling my life. I make plans, visualize my goals and move towards accomplishing them. I make plans, visualize my goals and move towards accomplishing them. 
I am worthy of having a healthy body. I am worthy of having a healthy body. My body is perfect just as it is. My body is perfect just as it is. Investing in my health is one of the best investments I can make. Investing in my health is one of the best investments I can make. I trust my body to tell me what it needs. I trust my body to tell me what it needs. I listen to my body's intuition. I listen to my body's intuition. I make time to tend to and care for my body. I make time to tend to and care for my body. I oversee my health. I oversee my health. My body is powerful. My body is powerful. I appreciate my body for all it does for me each day. I appreciate my body for all it does for me each day. I choose to prioritize my mental and physical health. I choose to prioritize my mental and physical health. I awaken each day feeling refreshed and energized. I awaken each day feeling refreshed and energized. I am healthy, happy and whole. I am healthy, happy and whole. Let the words of my mouth, let the words of my mouth and the meditation of my heart and the meditation of my heart be acceptable unto you, O Lord. Be acceptable unto you, O Lord. Thank you, Lord, for answering my prayers. Thank you, Lord, for answering my prayers. In Jesus' name, Amen. In Jesus' name, Amen. We have reached the end of the Sure Word Audio Devotion and the Declaration of the Sure Word Capsule. Please visit www.thesureword.org.uk for more capsules tailored to meet your specific needs. You can also request a Sure Word Capsule to be created for any challenge you are experiencing. Thank you for listening and confessing along. Please don't forget to share this audio devotion. You have been inspired, motivated, encouraged, and empowered to become the person God created you to be. For more encouraging words of faith, inspiration, and the resources to overcome your challenges, subscribe to this channel and click the bell icon to receive instant notification anytime we publish a new video. You will be the head and not the tail. You will rise above your challenges because you are more than a conqueror. Thank you. Have a gorgeous day. God bless you.